Hey guys, and welcome back to Adventures of Minecraft. I have been doing some little tinkery bits. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel, guys, to stay on top of the content. Anyway, I've finished it. Look, it's kind of cool. I put a bit of decoration on it, too. Put some hay, uh, wheat um, blocks around here, and I just put some decorative sort of... I don't know, decorative sort of trapdoors around the outside. So... We kind of had to put a different colour um, clay on the other side. One of you guys recommended doing red, uh, which I will consider, so thanks for the comment. Um, but when I went back to my base, like the little hut over there, I looked in the furnace and to my surprise, let me just show you, voila, I actually found some clay that I had in this smelting anyway that I just totally forgot about. So we're going to replace that and I think today we're going to go on uh, we're going to do some mining of course. I may actually try and get myself back to my base. Um, I want to get some diamonds. I want to possibly try and get some horses horses back. I just lost some trap doors then by doing that. Oosh. Yeah, so I want to try and get the horses back of course. To my base, a horse, of course. Back to my castle, sort of. Um, my castle effort. Ah, failing, failing with juicy. Okay, cool. I've been considering doing um, a charity live stream this weekend. Um, I want to know your guys' thoughts on that and what I should do for it. Um, I don't usually get a massive turnout for my streams anyway, so... Um, but I was thinking, what theme could I do? And possibly I could do some competitions that you guys can get involved in, um, which can happen quite regular dur during the actual... Um, <clears throat> during the duration of the stream also, so... Let me know on that. Maybe I can do give away some games or some humble bundles, because you get, like... You know, you get a few games that way. Um, but obviously I'm going to have to open up some sort of way from, to make donations. So who would the donations go to, of course. Those can go in there. Um, I need one more lead. Is there no leads in here? The iron. Oh, let's leave the iron there. One, one, two, three. We'll just make some more because i got quite a few bows. What am I doing? If you hold right click and drag, you'll do that. And then we'll leave one here. Yeah, so like who to give the donations to, what type of competitions, what type of games to do, and some epic stuff like that. Okay, so this is pretty beautiful. I've put some horse stockiness in here, so I've put two donkeys, I've put two white horses here. And um, I put a grey patched horse by here, and at the back I've got my mule on the right, and my donkey in here. Get off the donkey. The only problem is, is that these gates are not wide enough for a horse or a donkey to go through, which is quite a bummer. I want to put loads of wheat blocks up there too, so it looks pretty authentic. This horse is terrible at jumping too. Okay, let's get off. You and you. Okay, the only problem about going back to the Never is that we are really far away. I mean, we can go in the Never, of course. Um, but if I go, um, if I go in the direction of where my house is, my original base. Let me just turn the music up a little bit. Um, I need to travel a long way, and if I don't go far enough. I'll end up making a portal in a cave under the ocean, so that's the only problem. But the solution for that would be um, to look at a past episode and see the cords, and obviously do the mass for the never, or go in the never and just travel in the direction of my base. I just keep going until I hit the never, um, the never fortress I kind of used to make my wither spawner with the pads and all. If you remember that episode, which is in like. Series 2 of Adventures of Minecraft. It was quite a while ago now I did that. That's cool. Wheat. Yeah. Let's do this. So I think I'm going to do that. So there may be some jump cuts in today's episode. But I really want to get back to the base. And um, possibly try and link these two up as easy as I can. 
Uh, maybe do some rail system stuff. As you can see, my picks are almost dead. Which is quite a bummer. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. So, we're going to go in the never today. Hopefully not get lost. And try and join these two places together so I can... I don't have to worry too much about food and stuff like that. I might as well take all of this. My arm is pretty beefy as it is. I've got my bow, so we need to take some more arrows. We'll take that. Okay, so let's go in the never and see what happens. The last portal I made uh, was a fail. Um, it came up underneath the ocean, if you remember. And then I did a little bit of caving, which kind of failed also. Whoa! Whoa! It blew out the bloody portal! I don't even have any iron on me! I can't even relight it again! What the hell, creeper? Oh my... <clears throat> that darn creeper! Yeah, that's the way I went to go back home, I think. Oh, that... Oh, you were having a laugh and a joke or whatever you call it. How am I going to get back? I've got no choice now but to go to the other portal. That damn creeper, man. Um, there's no iron in the never at all, actually. Not, at all, not a smidgen. You were seriously having a joke. Okay, guys, it looks like we've got to go. Okay, let's go down here. I think there's a portal. This one that purrs underneath the ocean. <clears throat> I have no wood, so I can't really make any... Uh, I can't even make any mushroom soup if I get really desperate for food. I thought soul sand fell, by the way. Oh well. So I can't make any food if I need that. So I should just walk, really, rather than run. Okay, let's see where this goes. I assume I need to be going more towards zero zero than anything. That's roughly where my base would be. Yeah, this portal here was a fail, guys. So we need to go beyond this one. <clears throat> what are the chances in this? Okay, I'm going to jump cut now, and I'm going to go many, many blocks in this direction, which is probably the wrong way. Mm, okay, well, I'm going to jump cut now, and I'm going to try and suss out a way towards uh, my nether fortress I used for my wither spawner pads. Mm, I'm all nervous now, because I'm lost. Anyway, I'll be back once I actually get a bit more... Um, civilized here. Yeah, this situation is just getting real bad. I'll see you in a moment. Okay, so I've come to this point here. Mm, I'm trying to look for any anywhere where I've kind of intervened with the landscape. I'm pretty sure I haven't. Because mm, if you go this way, the X axis goes down as you can see. Okay, well, I'm going to start going in this direction now, to more towards zero, 0, My base is nowhere near zero, 0, 0, of course, but, um, you know, it's kind of main spawn, I think. Is zero, 0, like the main spawn point of the world? I assume so. Okay, so we've run out of food as well. The situation is getting rather treacherous. Okay, well, I'm going to continue onwards in the reverse direction now, guys. So I shall see you if I actually find any intervention from me whatsoever in the never. And hopefully we can fix this situation when that damn creeper blew up. Anyway, I will see you in just a moment. Okay, and we are back. I have been going for about three hours now. This is crazy. Let me just show you what I did. I have built the longest piece of never act ever in existence. Let me show you. Oh, I found my way back, sort of. Um, let me just show you, though. This took ages. Okay, so as you can see, I've been working like a
bitch on this rail by here. Um, if you look to the right, you can see a pumpkin down there. And I put those there when I was looking for a nether fortress like over a hundred episodes ago. So I did a bit of scouting of the area and I looked for... Um, I can hear a ghast. <laughs> Let's go. I looked for the most closest area I could get to to conjoin to my existing track. And I found this tunnel here that I made, so I'm going to follow it and hopefully it's going to take us back to um, our base. Um, this tunnel here, of course, is... Um, I kind of overshot the tunnel for the Never Fortress when I first started building it. <clears throat> so I kind of, in error from like a f like over a hundred episodes back, I have sort of found this that is going to help us. So I think we need to go in that direction. I think it may be this direction. Um, as you know, oh, I I kind of started heading towards zero zero. That was the plan. And I kind of found existing stuff I've made. We're going the wrong way now. <clears throat> this goes to a dead... Uh, yeah, you can see a pumpkin here. I think this goes to a dead end, actually. Oh, no, this is my track. This is my track. So we can break through here. I've broken my picks, too. And I've only got two cooked chicken. Oh, that is so epic. So, what we could do... Whoa! No, no, no! Get in, get in! Oh, you flipping idiot. I've had enough of explosions for one day. Okay, so what we could do here is make a turn in the road. Let me just put this here. Oh, Okay, let's go back to the base. <laughs> Finally. Yeah, so I could put a turn here, I guess. No, 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 no. That is impossible. That is impossible. Ghasts cannot see you through tracks. I've only got Neverack underneath me too. That's what this track is made of. Damn. I think as soon as we get back, we're going to do some enchanting too. Because i got 41 levels that I made up over the past few episodes of... Has he got a gold enchanted sword? Yeah. I've got a few levels that we've sort of gathered up from resource gathering in the past few episodes, so we're going to use this. We should be back at... Oh, we went the wrong way. We're at the Never Rail. Um, let's see if this... We're at the Never Fortress, I mean. Hmm, is there any wood here that should be? Yes. How do I make a minecart again? It's iron, isn't it? Oh, I was going to make a boat then. Why was I going to make a boat? Yeah, I went the wrong way, but as you can see, this is my wither pads that I made a few episodes back. Some of you told me that mobs don't spawn on half slabs, but these are like upright half slabs. But I may have to go through this design and edit it slightly. Um, let's go up here and see if there's any chests. Damn. When I was doing all that tracking, I come to the conclusion that, um... Hmm, nothing here. I want to make my episodes a little bit more worthwhile for you guys. And I was thinking, if I add more cuts in the video while I do this, so potentially, rather than recording for like a 20 minute session at a time, um, well, like... Yeah, there's no more eye in here, I don't think. Um, just do loads of cuts and work on a project. And obviously try and get it done in a video rather than doing multiple videos. If that makes any sense to you guys, let me know in the comments below. So, um, what I'm going to do now, I'm going to jump cut because I obviously need to run the opposite way of this track. But uh, when I get back to the, the portal that goes back to my base, um, I'll come back once I'm there. So, I'll see you in just a moment. Okay, we have arrived. Finally. I'm sure we went this way though when we went to discover the new generated land. I'm pretty sure we did. Well, we're here anyway, so let's go back to the over. Oh, I might need a rail car to see if there's one here. Definitely need to be taking flint and steel with me if I decide. Uh, well, I'm going to have to relight the portal anyway once I get there. 
And we're down to our last chicken piece. I get two. That's gotta be a glitch in the game eating two. Okay, my rail station's down here. We're so close now, guys. It kind of feels weird being back home, especially after all those episodes. Um, I think I'm going to try and invest in an ender chest as well today before we call it quits. Um, yeah, let's go. Hopefully there's no mobs on the traps too, on the, on the tracks, rather. And I can't remember if my rail door still works or not. It's been quite a while, but if you remember, my rail station has theoretically got an automated door, so when I arrive there, it may open and close behind me. Fingers crossed it does, that's the whole point of it, but I think the redstone may have broke um, during an update, because if you, if you know, well, as you know, I've been using the latest snapshots in my Adventures of Minecraft world quite well. Not quite recently, but for quite a while now. Quite a few months, I think, so. The redstone is broken. I'd assume it's broken anyway, but we'll soon find out. We're almost there now. I keep looking for a mini-map in the top right of the screen all the time, too, because I'm used to playing. What the hell? Feed the beast and stuff. That's not cool. Oh, I was going to consolidate the rail, wasn't I? I was going to make it one link instead of having one out and one in. Oh, and zombies now do hordes, don't they? They spawn in hordes. Get in quick. And they track you from up to like 80 blocks away as Doc M oh, experimented with. Okay, I wonder if this works. Oh, yeah. Get out! Well, it semi worked. We've got a rail cart going mental in it now. Where did the rail cart go? Oh, screw it. But it kind of worked. Um, there's a block missing though by here. Oh well. <laughs> okay, so what is the recipe for an ender chest? Never made one before. Never. Never thought that I would need one, but considering we're working away, we really do need one. Hmm. What is this turn to? I can't remember. Speed and... Regen? No, speed. I broke it, haven't I? Yes. Okay, I think I may actually need to tab out to make an ender chest. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a little montage now, I feel. Um... If I still got speed. Yeah, I'm going to do a montage, I feel. Um, we should do this as well. Efficiency free. Not bad. Uh, we could enchant some books too. Yeah, I'm going to do a little montage. Me putting myself a little backpack together to take with me. Um, but yeah, I'll see you in a moment. Um, I don't know if I'm going to put any music over it. I might just, you know, whatever. But let me know if you want more cuts in the videos, guys, so I can get more stuff done. Like I said, if I'm playing straight through, and um, not prone any cuts. I'm not going to be able to get up to too much. It's my old fireworks display still here. Oh, I do love my base. Oh, I've got to admit, it is kind of beautiful. I'm proud of this. You can understand why I kept the same world when the update came out. I could possibly start a new world, though, when the, the new biome update comes out for the oceans. <laughs> Which is going to be in Minecraft 1.7. Anyway, I'm going to cut now. I'm going to get myself a backpack together. And uh, we're going to try and head back to Horsey Warsy Land. So I'll see you in a moment. Right, we need some blaze powder to make um, Eye of Ender, I think. I've tried Googling the recipe for Ender Chest. And, um, and my internet's not working. So we're offline at the moment, which is kind of gay. Okay, so we need one of these. Uh, blaze powder and ender pearl, I think, to make an eye of ender, and then encase an obsidian. I think that's it. Right, let's go and look for some ender eyes, ender pearls, ender eyes, ender balls, however they call them. Who remembers this for a storage room? I'm really impressed with this. It's already open though. Oh no, the I, there was no doors on there anyway. Okay, so where is my goodies? That's my diamond collection. And music is being derpy. 
I'm still waiting for Google to load. That's how bad my internet is. Where would I put my epic stuff? Right, we need one of these. Mm, quartz. Where would my awesome stuff be? Over here? I've got ender eyes somewhere. They were originally in my diamond chest. Free obsidian, which sucks. Um, let's take some TNT back with us. We could take six buckets. Oh, here we go. We just need one. So it's blaze powder and one of these bad boys, which makes an eye of ender. How many ender pills have I got? Nine. Those are going to come in handy for when we go looking for the... Oh, I need food. Those are going to come in handy when I go looking for the... Um, the dragon. But as you know, we're going to go with a horse because we're going to differentiate the situation. Okay, I'm going to look for some obsidian. I will be right back in a moment. Okay, I'm still on the hunt for obsidian, but... Um, I think we can kind of fulfill our needs for um, food. So I think we're going to take two swords of us. We could take two picks. Power two. This is a nice bow. We'll take a shovel. Take a new axe. Okay, sweet. All this is going to go in the ender chest. Of course I had to make another eye of ender because um, we need two. Um, let's go down to my farm and get some potatoes. And uh, we can start growing those too. Also, oh yeah, sweet. Let's just jump in the water. And we can get some eggs too. On my chicken farm. My chicken farm's real nice. I like it. They look like proper chicken coops. Look at all the trees I planted around the castle too. I like it. Okay, so let's go and get some potatoes. Um, I may have to do some grinding for obsidian if I don't manage to find any, but I'm pretty sure I did have obsidian somewhere. I don't need any. Whoa, zombie. I can hear one. I can hear a zombie. I can hear it. Pretty loud. He could have spawned in with the, the redstone, I guess, in there. Okay, what's in here? I think we've got loads of ice in one of these. Yes. Hmm. Yeah, sometimes you get mobs that spawn in with the, the sheep. Right, we're going to get some potatoes, and those are going to come to go with us. This never act can go. These sticks, random wood. I'll leave the wheat here because we got a wheat farm. Okay, that will do. And then we'll just grab a rope of carrots. Well, that was kind of potatoes then. We'll grab those. <clears throat> okay, potatoes, carrots. I'll get rid of that. I'll despawn. <laughs> yeah, wasting food. Okay, time for the obsidian, guys. And I'll just be right back. And I think we can start making our way back to... Um, back to our horse ranch. And I think we're going to be pretty much kitted up for any situation there. We've got some nice tools. So uh, I'll see you in a moment. Okay, and we are back. Obsidian. Okay, let's craft this... And uh, this end chest. I never made one before. Where is my local crafting bench? There should be some in here. Yep. Okay. And like so. And then we can do the draggy waggy bit. And there we go. Bingo. Two ender chests. Perfect. So, what do I do? Leave one here and take the other one with me. I'll take. I'll put them down, put stuff in it and take both with me. I think I should leave one here for now. Let me know what I should actually do in the comments. 
I would be interested in what you think the best way which should be. Um, I'm going to leave these in here, though I don't really need them where I'm going. Oh, I need Silk Touch, don't I, for the Ender Chest. Ooh, let's see if we've got a Silk Touch book. I'm pretty sure you need a Silk Touch book for it now. Did I not have a Silk Touch book? I'm pretty sure I did. Um, hmm. We can always try for one right now. Power. I think Silk Touch would probably be a higher level. Knockback. Okay, we got three levels to try and get one. It's not going to happen though. Nope, that was sucky. That was not good at all. I do like the setup I got here. It looks like a... I don't know. It looks like a shrine, you know? Like an overgrown shrine. I love it. I love it a lot. Okay. So we're going to put the chicken in here. Carrots, potatoes, the eggs. We'll take some obsidian. Buckets. TNT. What's missing? Maybe another shovel? We can take another bow. Arrows. Two stacks of arrows. These got sharpness two on each. Keep half a stack. Hmm, maybe if take a few some string and some diamonds. I really don't think I need anything else actually. I think that's pretty cool. Um, I'll probably get back to the horsey warsy land and realize that there is something I totally forgot. Needs. Well. Oh, it's some sand too, because I want to make some glass. Oh, and I may actually have some... I may actually have some... Some clay. May have some clay. But I think I've turned all my stock into bricks. Yes. I turned it all into bricks because at the time there was nothing else you could do. Hmm. That's so true. Um, some coal, possibly. I'm just trying to think. What, should, what do you reckon I should take with me? What do you guys think that I should take? Obviously, I'm going to be leaving it on this episode to go back. But what would have you taken with you? And some diamonds. Okay, so let's go down to the storage. And, uh, yeah, I'm probably going to jump cut back to the base. Back to the other base. Oh, no! I'm glad he wasn't a zo uh, a creeper or a zombie. Where would he spawn? In here. Damn you. We'll take ten Demontios. And that pretty much covers everything. This is miscellaneous wood in here. And doors. Yep, that's good. When I was 17. Okay, let's take this off the hot bar because I don't want to be placing it. Um, okay, so we can make um, an enchanting table when we get back to the base now, to the new base, which would be perfect. So I think enchantments is all we need. If we need some more resources, we can obviously go mining for that. Da, da. Is there enough room? Uh, we'll keep some eggs on us there. Definitely need to keep this. I think we're all ready to go. So let's sleep for the night and let's go. Wow. I think this episode's going on quite long. I hope you don't mind, guys, and I hope you're enjoying it as much as I am. Okay, perfect. So we've been replenished. I could check, take those bookshelves with me. Mm, possibly. 
Anyway, let's go. I haven't actually used an ender chest before. It'd be um, quite a new experience for me to open this up when we get to um, the base. But anyway, if you're new to the series, this is my castle. Um, I've been I've been working on this for a long time, and um, it's finished. I really have nothing much more to do with it. I'm really happy with it. Um, some cracked stone would be really nice to put in here. But I've got like a shrine area over here with like some potted plants and and then we've got the big main gate and we've got this statue by here which is some um, it's not really symbolic of anything but it looks kind of unusual. And this is the front and it took me ages to excavate this. But yeah, definitely needs a lot more detail on it. Maybe I can do that um, some other time in the future but... Not today. Okay, so the next goal, I think probably from part, from the next episode onwards, would be to bring some horse back here and set up um, a horse barn, probably on the outskirts of the castle. That would be the best, um, best way to do this. For sure. Okay, so this way is a no-no. We don't need to go this way. Um, it's this way, of course. Um, we could use... Oh, I took the cart with me, didn't I? Hmm, took the cart. That was pretty silly of me. And these just got tree stuff in it, I think. Yeah, oh, I could have rid the rail halfway down at least. <laughs> okay, well, that's something I can think of in the future, because we obviously need to make additions to the rail track now. Anyway guys, I'm going to jump cut now and I'll see you when we get back to uh, back to the horsey base. So see you in just a moment. Oh look, the turning off is right by here. Very close. Didn't have to go too far. Anyway, I'll see you when I get back to the horsey base. Okay, I decided to record this bit just in case of um, entertainment purposes because this rail um, it's not secure, this line across the sky. So I'm going to record me attempting this. Hopefully there will be no guests. But as long as I keep sprinting, I should be fine. This is pretty much straight line now. Am I sprinting? Sprint. Okay, this is pretty much a straight line all the way back to the portal. You'll probably, when I get there... Um, You'll see which direction I went in, which is pretty much behind the portal and that way. Um, you can see where I've... well, let me go a bit further forward. Up there, you can just see it up in the top right, is where I um, built a rail, or well, attempted a long time ago also. So we're quite linear to something I've kind of attempted before. Which would be a better idea for me to link that up there, if possible. Okay, let's do this. Whoop! Ooh, shizzle me nizzle. Okay, hopefully this will make us go faster. If you sprint and keep tapping jump, it'll make you travel faster. Okay, so, yeah, this is what blew out, so we've got this. And do this. Uh, this, so as you can see, it wasn't too far away after all, which is pretty epic. I hope this doesn't need all seven at the same time as I go through the portal. No. I'm so curious to how a, a creeper went in here. It might have went in there. Um, mm, it may have, actually I'll put my end of storage up in here. It may have went in there before I torched this area up. But we're here, and my horse is gone. He was right by here. Okay, and the storage would be nice by... By here, I guess. And bingo, we've got all our goodies. We don't need to take those out of there yet. Apart from the potatoes and the carrots, of course. But yeah, we're doing pretty epic. Let's go find my horse before we go, though. Did I leave him in here? If he's despawned, I'm not going to be a happy juicy. Definitely not. Or did I take him over to the house before I left? I can see. There he is, me old boy. Oh, I left him tied up. I think. Did I? 
I can't remember. Anyway, guys, I want to say thanks for watching Adventures of Minecraft. It's been a true pleasure. Any suggestions, let me know in the comments below. I will be live streaming over the internet doing a charity thing. Not quite sure what it is yet. Any ideas for that, though? Please let me know in the comments also. But uh, yeah, this is awesome. I think we should... We need to work on something new now we've got all the goodies. Um, maybe we could work on a sort of an enchanting area here um, for stocks. And maybe we can do potions. And um, then we're going to go and take on the Ender Dragon, of course, with our horse. We've got some horse diamond armor. Wouldn't it be... Oh, I'm. Oh, I can't do it. I'm really curious now whether I can put an enchantment on horse armor. If you guys let me know, if you guys know that, let me know in the comments also. But thanks for watching this penultimate episode of Adventures of Minecraft, and I shall be seeing you soon. So thanks for watching and peace out. Bye, bye, horse. Bye, bye, donkey. Bye, mule. Bye, muley. Okay, guys. Thanks and peace. All right.